Hey guys, it's the Swell Clappy, and today inside of this monster analysis video, we're going to be going over Arachno Flame, and I'm going to tell you guys whether or not he is worth getting out of his current path event. So let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, so Arachno Flame is an attacker, and his traits are Fear Immunity, Burn Immunity, and Precision. Those are some really bad traits. Yeah, not very good traits at all, and his roads are Sword and Mask, which are actually pretty decent, but his traits are really bad. So now let's go on down to his pros and his cons. So his access to three tortures and burn, ignite, and hellfire, which are all pretty great. He also has access to fear as an attacker, which is really cool. He's got great relics and strong power. And then his cons are fire and water meta, pitiful levels of raw damage, horrible life and speed, terrible trait, which is very true. It does say except status caster, but honestly, I think even the status caster is just bad. And then easily denied by everything except fear because of the trade abysmal cooldowns on extra turn moves meaning you can't infinitely chain and he's screwed against torch immunity and anticipation so now let's go on down to the move set so he has a 20 fire damage with an extra turn he's got a hellfire ignite with an extra turn he also has an aoe earth damage with an extra turn and then he also has an aoe hellfire and ignite that you could use instead which is honestly better in my opinion and then he also has a fear and burn which is pretty decent so yeah overall pretty good move set actually it has some pretty decent moves in there it's not like super op but honestly they're pretty decent and he is an attacker so it's not like he has to have a ton of stuff he just has to be able to do damage which he can do as long as they don't have anticipation if they have that he's kind of screwed but it seems all right his trait is horrible though which makes him like kind of bad just because his trait is really really bad even though his movesets are okay it just makes him kind of bad. So honestly, I would not go for Arachno Flam. Maybe just go for him as far as you can during the event, but don't spend money on him or anything. Don't rank him up. He's just not really good. But yeah, let me know down in the comments what you guys think of Arachno Flame. I could be completely off, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.